a report from investment bankups has revealed that Waymo would likely command up to 60% of the driverless taxi service market by 2030. According to the financial firm, Waymo's dominance of the self-driving taxi industry could force the world's prominent car makers to adopt its autonomous technology. Ups noted in its report that global revenues from self-driving taxi services could reach up to $2.8 billion per year by 2030. The financial firm further stated that Waymo's lead in the driverless industry has managed to reach a point where only a few automakers, such as General Motors and Daimler, would likely be able to rival the Google-based company. UPS expects that by 2030, 12% of cars sold will be used for driverless taxi fleets, with a total of 26 million autonomous vehicles in operation. As a result of the emergence of driverless vehicles, the investment bank expects that private car sales will see a 5% decline, according to a report from the manufacturer. The advent of self-driving taxi services will not happen in the next few years, however, according to UPS recent report. Depending on the public's acceptance of the technology, the financial firm expects that demand for self-driving vehicles will really take off around 2026. The bank also predicts that the adoption of the technology will vary between different markets. So far, however, UP states that Waymo currently stands as the company that could benefit most from the emerging self-driving taxi market, considering that Google has been committed to the technology for years. Unlike most auto players, Google focused on full self-driving technology from the very beginning, more than five years before the auto industry started working on it, the report noted. UPS report on Waymo may very well prove to be accurate. The company, after all, has already garnered 5 million miles of physical testing and 5 billion miles of virtual testing. More vehicles are being added to its fleet as well. Earlier this year, CEO John Krafzik unveiled the company's latest car in its fleet, the all-electric Jaguar I-Pace. According to the CEO, Waymo is hoping to deploy as many as 20,000 I-Pace driverless taxis within two years of the vehicle's production. While Waymo has a lead in driverless systems for now, Tesla's planned ride-sharing network might prove to be a surprise competitor in the autonomous taxi market. During the company's first quarter earnings call, Musk noted that the Tesla network, a system that enables electric car owners to deploy their vehicles for ride-sharing, would be akin to a hybrid of Uber, Lyft, and Ebb. Close quote. It's sort of like a combination of Uber, Lyft, and Ebb type of thing, where you can own your car and have a higher percent usage of an autonomous electric car. You can say it's available generally to anyone who wants to use it, when you are not using it. You can recall it at will. You can restrict usage to only friends and family, or only users who are five-star. Close quote. Musk, however, noted that Tesla must first develop and refine its full self-driving suite before such a service is rolled out. Nevertheless, Musk stated that Tesla is making good progress in the development of its autonomous driving suite, 